came through a time where you, know, you either took up the piano or you took up the violin or you took up the guitar. My mother actually wanted me to play guitar for some strange reason, I don't know why. Yeah, with the benefit of hindsight, I, actually, I, I wasn't actually aware of actually having any aptitude for it. Um, but I've always been one of those people that has always been very, very good at everything they sort of take on. So like, you know, once I you know, get an interest in something or get a, develop a passion for it, I'm usually pretty good at it. I sort of asked for a guitar for Christmas and, um, you know, I didn't really think I'd have much of a chance of getting one, but I just happened to be in town about the week before Christmas and I spied my father with a, you know, strange-shaped cart um, cardboard carton under his arm, and I thought, eh, yeah, you know, something's afoot. So I got my first steel string guitar, and of course, you know, Dad, who knew nothing about guitars, really, um, you know, apart from the fact that he didn't want to spend too much money on it. I find guitar as being an expression of so many things. It's, it's an expression of my soul. It's an expression of my personality. And it's, it's, it's an expression of what I think about the world around me at any given time. When I listen to Hendrix, when I listen to Clapton, you know, when I listen to you know, Jeff Beck, you know, any, any number of, of you know, amazing guitar players out there, um, there's a communication. There's, there's, there's something actually in there. I, you know, I mean, I can listen to, let's say, for example, Jeff Beck, you know, who, who would probably be you know, my all-time favourite guitar player. But Beck just has this way of actually, you know, talking through his instrument, and uh, and it's very pure. It's a very pure form of communication. You know, it's about the truth. Um, one of my other, you know, guitar sort of mentors, if you like, it was Carlos Santana. He's always sort of espoused that. You know, that. I guess my goal as a guitar player is to be able to do that myself. Um, and I don't think you can actually understand how to go about doing that until you first understand how to go about interpreting it from listening to somebody else. This process of actually expressing emotion through the instrument is, you know, is, is is a very pure thing, and it's a very difficult thing to do. And it's not sort of something you can just sort of say, okay, guys, well, I'm going to pick up a guitar and I'm going to play something that's that's really going to, you know, you, know, you walk out of the room with tears in your eyes. <laughs> Blues is, is my thing. You know, I, I don't think there's any greater truth in music than the blues. You know, it's derived from that, you know, that, that vast um, history of the you know, slavery in the Mississippi and you know, there's, there's no greater truth, I think. Thank mm -hmm. you.